There's nothing like chilling with my girls Just me and my divas taking over the world Look so cute. Okay, listen. So, as for the 360 lace frontal that they sent me, let's get into this real quick. I'm gonna make a wig. They did send me some bundles, they sent me two bundles. So, a pre plugged tweeze hairline it has a comb and the adjustable straps at the nape. Nice and combs in the front. I love when you got everything. Like, listen, I think all companies should make their 360s like this for real because I hate sewing combs in them because sometimes it'd be just doing the most. But they did a really good job with this construction of this. I will this, be so. showing you guys the unit once I make it. All right, you guys. So it is early in the morning. Too early for this. But this is the 360 frontal wig that I make using the 360 frontal and two bundles of hair. I had to actually go ahead and use like a little bit of my own straight hair that I had left over for like two rows because it wasn't enough. And I started spacing them. So it really needed to be three bundles because the tracks were not as long. I went ahead and made a tiny little part right there um, when I was washing it. And that's about it. The pre-plugged hairline is so pretty on this unit, like really, really pretty. Um, I, I washed it and let it air dry on this mannequin, put it on my balcony last night. So came out really, really nice. Um, I just gotta cut the lace off. That is a, their bob with a bang. So we shall see how that goes. But I'm gonna use this stuff right here I'm going to use this cheap Con Air curling wand, a curling iron. And, you know, I always use, like, a styling mousse prior to... We're going to record the video like this um, because I really don't feel like going and getting my Canon and doing all of the unhooking. So I'm going to use my phone for this video. So, look, this is the tripod I'm going to be using. I'm, I just hooked it up. You see this little piece right here? This is from my selfie stick. It comes off, so I'm going to put my phone up on here. And being that it's right by the sun, we're going to get perfect lighting. So, yes... Ghetto Fab, I just took this piece off of my selfie stick. So, the first thing we're gonna do is I'm gonna use this. Stop all the clocks, I'll be with you. You're all I think about. Pull me apart if you have to. But you're all that I think about. Tell me you can to you're all that I think about.
pull it. Make sure it's tight. This is enough because it just gets really stretchy. I to where I need it. Alright you guys, so there goes my elastic. This is not the full video tutorial, but this is like the raw uncut version of how I do shit. Oh, did I say that on camera? Sexy moments, you know what I'm saying? What? Freaking 360 fits so good, okay? Now let's get into the rest of this. All video. done. I hope you guys enjoyed some of the footage. So they sent me um, two bundles of their virgin straight hair. I can't remember if it's virgin. I mean, I can't remember if it's Brazilian, Peruvian. First of all, I want to say this. The two bundles was not enough. I had to use like one quarter of a bundle of my own straight hair, um, which was really good quality hair as well. So it matched perfectly because the bundles that they did send me were really good quality. Um, I was kind of like scared that mine would match up to it, but they actually matched up really, really well. Um, it's just that the bundles were, I think they were 20 inches each. And sometimes with straight hair, you need more than, you know, the normal. I think when you use like body wave or different textures, you don't need as many bundles. But when it comes to like bone straight, to me, you always need like an extra bundle. Hair texture is gorgeous. So like I said, it matched up perfectly, blended, color, everything. And the frontal was so easy to create because it already came with combs in it, which was great, a blessing. Because I really do appreciate that also it did come with the adjustable strap in the nape and the comb in the nape so their 360 was like really easy i love when you can get like a 360 that's already constructed for you like you know what i'm saying combs adjustable strap nape good to go like seriously good to go. i don't know why i'm so dressed up today like i'm going somewhere so far i'm gonna take my scalpage concealer which is nothing but basic makeup concealer and this little tiny brush and I'm going to just rub it in that part. Kiss the smoke right off my lips. I crave the taste of your tattoos. It's all you want. It's so psychotic. Boy, you know what you have to. Top of vision. My intentions. I can make you feel alive. Every night. My heart to right. My head to wrong. Fight inside of me. When nothing works except the hurt. You feel so good to me. It's not enough. Come give me love and leave me dead. Just be honest and say, oopie doopie doo. I don't even know what that was, but I did a hell of a job on this wig. I'm saying, I'm gonna tell you why. So last week I called myself making a 360. It wasn't for me, it was just for my website. I was making a 360. Also, why is it, why is the hooks upside down on the back of this? They should just do a better job of sewing them hooks and pay attention. 
It wasn't the hooks, it was me. Why did I sew the lace 360 frontal upside down? I don't even know how I did that. And so I sewed the entire wig. I made the entire freaking wig, okay? But sometimes it gets a little bit tricky to situate the 360 on a mannequin hat because if you put it where you would want it to be, like on the top, your wig will come out just gigantic. So I have learned that over the months of experimenting with these wig. But anyway, either way, it was a really great experience working this with this one. It really sits so nice and it's nice and snug. So it is 20 inches and of course on camera it does appear to be longer because you know where I sold the tracks. If it was a lace wig, 20 inches would not fall this long. But when you make them, it really is. So this would probably be like a 22, 24 inch in the lace wig girl. But either way, the hair is great quality. Now, if you want it fuller, of of course it all is 20 inches the, the, the frontal the bundles and everything so of course it's not layered if I was to layer it or cut it it would give more body and volume so I do like the fact that this is snug and I didn't have to fight with it you know I got my own baby hairs like I use my own baby hairs but I'm saying no the pre-plugged hairline is so nice like girl that just melt right into your scalp but you just want to smack your mama well, not literally smack up a smack somebody. But yeah, so my first wig, I don't really know if this is my first wig friendly for beginners, especially if you don't know how to make a wig, but trust and believe you can get you some nice 360 hairs right from the website with some bundles. Um, definitely. So big shout out to RPG Show and of course my first wigs. Congratulations. I hope you guys do really well in the future as well as that. All the coupon codes and everything else will be listed for you guys below. Make sure you thumbs this video up because you love me so much and I'll see y'all in a new to come video. And if I didn't say it already, because sometimes my memory is a little blank, I love you guys.